Hey, Loopline here. In this video, I want to go over the Do Follow Test add-on. If you don't have it installed, click Add on, Show Available Add ons. When the list comes up, find the Do Follow Test add on and install it. And once it's installed, Add ons down here, we have the Do Follow Test add on. And what this does is if you have a link on a page and you must have the link on the page that you're looking for, it will go through and analyze that link and tell you if it's a do follow link or a no follow link. So if I have 500 links that I've built, maybe I've ordered a service from someone, maybe I've built them myself, whatever, and I want to go through and see if they are do follow, no follow, I can load the list, put in my URL, one URL, and then check and see if that link is do follow or no follow. So let's do it. I'm going to load some target sites here, and I prepared a few ahead of time. And I'm going to just set this connections down to like 25. And then um, my website, I'm going to put in scrape stuff here. So, and you can see that it's putting that all the way through here. And I'm just going to hit start, and it's going to go through here and look at all my links and tell me what they are. And so. No follow turns up red, do follow turns up green, and as it reads through here, it'll give you the status and that sort of thing. And then all the information down here as well, the actual counts. And then when it's done, we're going to have some various export options as well. And so I'm just going to pause this video until it's done. And so we're all done. And under export, I get the option to export just do follow, just no follow, or all URLs. And so I wound up with uh, 22 do follow and 13 no follow. So um, nice mix there. And this is a great add on that lets you see at a glance everything you have in the way of do follow and no follow. And that is how the do follow test add on works.